If you are looking out for yourself, look out. Is your favorable letter I? Listen. The cause of most of our problems is I. No matter how we spell it. Change your favorite word from I to you. The truth is no one makes it on their own. Everyone who has ever done a kind deed for us or spoken one word of encouragement to us has entered into the makeup of our character and of our thoughts as well as our success. There is nothing quite so dead as a self-centered man, a man who holds himself up as a self-made success and measures himself by himself and is pleased with the result. Don't become a legend in your own mind. The man who lives for himself is a failure even if he gains much wealth, power or position, he is still a failure. Conceit makes us fools. The book of Proverbs reminds us, do you see a man wise in his own eyes? There is more hope for a fool than for him. The man who believes in nothing but himself lives in a very small world. The best way to be happy is to forget yourself and focus on other people. The bigger a man's head gets, the easier it is to fill his shoes. The only reason pride lifts you up is to let you down. A swelled head always proves there is plenty of room for improvement. Even postage stamps become useless when they get stuck on themselves. The greatest magnifying glasses in the world are a man's own eyes, even when they look upon his own person. Egotism is the only disease where the patient feels well while making everyone else around him feel sick. It blossoms but bear no fruit. Those who sing their own praises seldom receive an encore. Don't think too much of yourself. Try to cultivate the habit of thinking of others. This will reward you. Selfishness always brings its own revenge. When you find yourself on a high horse, the best thing to do is to dismount at once. You can't push yourself forward by patting yourself on the back. It's fine to believe in ourselves, but we mustn't be too easily convinced. An egotist is his own best friend. I think that people who are deeply in love with themselves should get a divorce. The man who only works by himself and for himself is likely to be corrupted by the company he keeps. I've observed that those who boast of being self-made usually have a few parts missing. You can recognize a self-made man. His head is oversized and his arms are very long enough to pat himself on the back. A conceited person never gets anywhere because he thinks he has already arrived. The higher you go in life, the more dependent you become on other people. Work together with others. Remember the banana. Every time it leaves the bunch, it gets peeled and eaten. Reckless would make a nice stand if they would just get together. Few burdens are heavy when everyone lives. Thanks for watching. Write in the comments which quote you like the most. Take care.